A restaurant can be somewhat like a community center, particularly in a small town, a place where you hear the latest news, the latest joke, and meet the latest arrivals. Well, in the community of Gladeville, that place is the Glade Diner, a place where we catch up with Rob Wiles. All right, over up. That's pretty much a constant refrain at the Glade Diner in the Gladeville community near Mount Julia. Breakfast and lunch Monday through Friday, owner Sandra Stites serving up tasty food, which can't be by accident, can it? There's no real recipe, it's just sometimes it turns out right and sometimes it don't. <laughs> they do just about every time. The recipes, maybe not written down, but held snugly in the mind of the cook, Sandra herself. And if you throw her a curve, I need a country ham pancake. Country ham pancake? Okay. Why, she'll just whip one up, each one designed to please her steady customers. We see the same people over and over, and I get all your construction crews and all you local farmers and all, all you working men, and then I get the older ones that's retired. And I was open on Saturday for about nine months, but everybody's in Providence or Lebanon or Murfreesboro. So I thought, well, since I'm retired, I'll just take that Saturday right back. Lord Joe's train wreck, pancakes, are they ready? What table is this going to? Uh, this is going to right there. Okay. French toast. Home fries. Nobody leaves here hungry unless they choose to. In fact, Sandra is thinking about helping out the folks who eat a little too much. I'm going to get me two old recliners and put them in a corner somewhere and rent them out for 20 minutes at a time so they can all sit a while and rub their bellies and then go. <laughs> I believe I could use that myself sometimes, that recliner. I'm going to get me some, some monogahide with some duct tape. <laughs> Whew. <laughs> they get big crowds in there. Breakfast time, lunch time, all the time, particularly today. Today is Friday. It's catfish day. Y'all going to eat some catfish today? Uh, yes, please. It's nine ounce fillets. It's the best catfish you'll ever have. We throw it out of here on Fridays. It's very good. Everybody loves the catfish. It's the best you'll find around. It's just got a good mild taste to it and it don't have any of the old black skin on it for bones or anything. It's just, it's just a good quality fish. We batter it and deep fry it. And it will get a little bit behind on Fridays because we will fry it as you're ordering and we can't keep up because it's a small kitchen. We don't get too far behind, but you, you might have to wait maybe six minutes. Best catfish in Tennessee. Of course, Michael could be biased. He is Sandra's nephew, so let's ask the server. Wait now, that's Misty, Sandra's daughter. And this is Cindy, also Sandra's daughter. Why, no wonder the place has such a family feel. The whole family is here. Even visiting grandkids get to help out. This is the kind of place where even the customers want to pitch in. These farmers around here, they keep me supplied during this time of year with my squash and my cucumbers and my tomatoes. And every morning, whatever they bring me from their garden, I'll be on the menu. And so today I have cucumber salad and I have squash casserole and homegrown tomatoes. Whatever they bring me, that morning, whatever it is, is what I'm going to work in the menu somewhere today. And then there's Noel Reese, who is recovering from a stroke and decided one day that washing dishes would be good for him. So that's what he does, volunteers to wash the dishes at the Glade Diner. Why here? It's everything. It's good and friendly and everything. Noel is right. It is everything. The food, of course. I mean, Sandra knows how to do that for sure. But she also has the recipe for making a place that not only satisfies your hunger,
but lifts your spirits a bit too. All righty, boys, y'all enjoy. I love the little place and I love everybody really that walks in here. They're all just people who seem to love each other. And Gladeville is a small community and they all know each other and think they're all family. It's different than anything I've ever done. Some days it's harder than anything I've ever done, but for the most part it's good every day, every day. Yeah, you'll be glad you went to the Glade, the Glade Diner in Gladeville.